Today we're going to learn how to quickly format text that we might find online or in a document so that it looks nice in Microsoft Word. To do this we're going to be using something that's from the Colorado State Courts. So it's some state documents that you might use to research an argument or in order to understand the history of something. Something that a historian might use on a regular basis. And If you notice we have this document and it looks very nice and neat. It's all justified and everything else. But if we're to copy this and then paste this into Microsoft Word, it doesn't necessarily play well with others. So we're going to go ahead and paste this, and as you can see, it doesn't line up real well, it's shortened, and there's just lots of extra line breaks. Now there's two ways we could handle this. We could click on each line break, or arrow down to them, and delete them each individually, which isn't bad if we've got a couple of passages, but it gets very tedious if we've got a lot of things to do. So today we're going to somewhat automate this task. What we're going to do is we're going to go up here to the replace option and click replace and you can see it's already got some stuff in here from earlier for me so we're just going to delete that we're going to click on more we're going to click on special and then we're going to go up here to paragraph marks which inserts that little character there when we click find on a paragraph mark it finds the end of a line a return or a paragraph break so if, as we click keep clicking through these we can see each of them is exactly where a line breaks and if we replace it with nothing it just simply deletes it so we can go through like this and delete each and every one of them if we want to leave one we can click next um, and in fact we can use these little keys here the R and the F to uh, automate this a little bit so if I hit F you see it jumps to the next one if I keep doing that then I hit it R it'll replace that and so we can speed this process up quite a bit um, the last thing that we can do with this is we can just simply do replace all and if you'll notice it gets rid of all of them sometimes we want sometimes we don't in this case probably wouldn't be the ideal situation although this does leave us with our normal line breaks which we can go back into and insert our paragraphs wherever we want um, but it gets rid of all the rest of the formatting so this is a quick and easy way to format a document so that the lines match up and can be resized however you want I hope you enjoyed learning this and you can see how we can take turn this from this